For some of the boys on this trip, is it their first time here to Australia? Oh yes, the 20 boys, it is their first time to Australia and they love it here. Every experience they had so far is new for them. The weather playing um, at night, which is something they're not familiar with. Uh, the travel, but I think the boys, uh, they love the experience. You know, those challenges will shape them for life. So we were just grateful, uh, myself and the boys and the rest of the uh, officials were just grateful to be here. Standing with me is one of the outstanding props that we're playing on the field today, Devita Asi. Uh, he was absolutely dominant with his ball carries and one of the standouts. How did you feel out there? I uh, feel, feel grateful for coaches for teaching me that. Uh, I can't believe that I have a good game today. Uh, it's amazing, it's an amazing game to act too. For you personally, how has the tour been coming from Tonga to Australia? Uh, high, feel high, but when we are out here, it's look easy, everything is. And the game out there, what was it like playing against the West Tigers? It's different yeah. because the, the speed is too fast and, and the mindset is too, they uh, think quickly, they think quickly, the play. Um, feedback for our team, we had to have one high. And that's it. And, and what, for yourself, would you love to play for uh, the Matema Tonga one day? For me, uh, I'll play mathematics. I think the highlight of our trip is uh, being able, these kids being able to get the opportunity to meet NRL players and especially Tongan players like Olokau Atu, uh, Kuli Kefu, uh, Andrew Fifita and Devita Jr. Bangai came down here. And, you know, it was um, so heartwarming for these kids to see um, a great example that their older brothers are setting for them. When they shared about the sacrifice, uh, that they put aside money to come and play for Donga for nothing, uh, was one of the most inspiring things for our young Tongan players. Here in Australia, you have access to great resources. You have great trainers and coaches. Back at home, we just go with what we have. And, and that's how we, we are. Um, we just train with whatever resources we have, and we put up the best performance, and hope the Tongan community will be proud of what these boys have come up with. A, you know, more of a good uh, experience for the Tongan boys experiencing playing rugby league. For a lot of them, it's the first time playing rugby league, 95% of the squad, first time travelling, so to start off something, um, and hopefully it grows into something bigger in the future. How have you seen this game unfold so far? Yeah, it's been, um, yeah, it's, been, it's always an experience for these young boys. Uh, first time in, in uh, Australia playing in these sort of conditions. Um, yeah, so it's a, yeah, it's, 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 it's a, first half has been an experience, but hopefully they come back in the second half. How good is it, the Tongan music in the background? Are you, are you enjoying the support that the, the Tongan boys are getting so far? Yeah, for, for, for sure, yeah. I mean, you know, um, since we've arrived in day one, uh, the Tongan community has really come down to support these young boys, especially the extended families. Um, but yeah, we've been really welcome in Australia, and uh, thank you to the community for the support. It's the Tongan spirit. <laughs>